Yo, what's good everyone, Nick Smith is back. NBA draft. Let's get into this. Let's get into the NBA draft. This is a new, a new like, I don't know, it looks different. It's just the uh, the customization or whatever. It's just a different, different screen to what I'm used to seeing. How do we do this? Oh, wait, so you can, okay, the draft hasn't even started, but we can, we can start making trades already. First of all, this guy has to go. This guy, Norman Powell, let me show you his contract. It is on a team option. I mean, we can decline his option, but I might as well just trade him anyway. So I'll trade Norman Powell. It's two second round picks. I'm going to take that. Oh, actually, I'll take this one. I'll go for a... They're both second round picks. Any mini money, mo. Catch a tinker by the toe. If it holds, let it go. Any mini money, mo. Mo means no. I'll take this one. I'll take pick 10 of second round. I mean, let's just see if we can keep trading up. Um, Alright, there. That's the original trade. So, let's start the NBA draft. The Utah Jazz will select with the number one overall pick, Al Bryan. But I guess I'll make this go quickly. And if a trade offer gets... You know, I'll just do some editing. And if anything comes up, then I'll let you know. If not, then I'll skip to the end of the draft. <laughs> Andrew K is the MJ of this draft. Wow. Okay. How do you make this go quicker? Oh, you press triangle. Right. I got it now. You stupid. There's been a trade. The Knicks first round pick in Gallinari for Brook Lopez and a 2017 Lakers pick. Well, they must not, they must not know that we're going to be good by 2017. So the Wizards are making trades out here for pick 14. And not even gonna say that guy. And they get this guy, 6'11, 250. Carlo Quinn and Channing Fry for the Cavaliers 25th overall pick. And Sasha. Oh, Andrew Bogut gets traded to the Clippers. He had fights against the Clippers. I've seen him in a fight with Blake Griffin, so that's it's kind of funny. Whoa! You have received 23 trade offers for your next pick. Would you like to view them? Yes, I would actually. No thank you, 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 no thank you. Ah, uh, none of these trades are very good. You know what, let's actually draft someone, let's end the comments, let's draft someone. I've never drafted anyone in the second round. This guy is 7 foot 2. They're all like 7 feet tall, damn. But he's the tallest, he's the tallest out of all of them. Yeah. Let's get Randall Harmon. Number 37 pick goes to the Lakers. Virginia Tech, 7 foot 2, Randall Harmon. So that's the end of the draft. The power forward seems like the power forward position seems to be pretty heavy in this draft class. Four out of the top five players are power forwards, which is pretty crazy. And he's a small forward that is 6 foot 8. And his secondary position is a power forward. So pretty much, these guys are all power forwards. Wow. I'll just sign him for that little money, but I don't think he's making it onto the roster. Team slash player options. Going to accept Oladipo. Morrow. Um, $3.5 million. I'll accept Morrow. Definitely accepting Randall. Hollis Thompson, I won't accept. I didn't really play very well with Hulk Thompson, and he didn't really get many minutes. I will accept Bruno Caboclo, though. But Wiggins accepted. Damn, I, I wanted Wiggins so badly. Let's advance, though. Qualifying offers. Myers Leonard. I'll accept him. Why not? And my free agents. Kobe Bryant. Damn, okay. One year contract of 12 million, almost 13 million for Kobe can be a player option and he can have a no trade clause what do you say to that uh, offer contract he'll take this into consideration you know when I have made up my mind okay double G Gerald Green he, he, he's playing really well to start out of the year for the Miami Heat I like that I like five million a year for Gerald Green okay give him some time to mull this one over you know he's a player that might get traded but as of now two year 8 million, that's quite cheap actually. Let's get into this. First day of free agency, I'm pumped. And I tell you what makes me even more excited. 
Saying that LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, Miami, Miami thing right there, that just gets me excited, man. As a Heat fan, I kind of like that right there. I'm sad that LeBron left, but what can you do? Going back to his hometown, this man, Kobe Bryant, you have to sign Kobe Bryant. So let's accept that. $9 million for one year. I mean, I mean, this is crazy to me. This is crazy to me. I have a chance to get LeBron James again. I'm not going to do it. I just can't do it, all right? I know some of you guys in this comment section are going to be like, how in the world are you not going to re-sign LeBron? I mean, not re-sign, but how, how are you not going to go after LeBron? I've done it before. I've got LeBron in other My GM series. I'm not going to do it again. I'm going to do it for all the realistic guys, and I'm going to try and get somebody else that isn't LeBron. I'm not going to get Wade as a Heat fan. I just don't really want Wade because... I'd rather, I'd, I want him to sign with the Heat. I mean, this free agency is not that great. But what I plan to do, I guess, is sign some players which then I can trade later for somebody else. So I plan to sign a whole bunch of players and then trade those players for Andrew Wiggins. That's what I plan to do. So let's sign Hassan Whiteside, negotiate a contract. And then trade, maybe trade Hassan Whiteside or keep him on the squad. We do have Boogie Cousins though. So, that's the reason why I don't really want Hassan Whiteside. And he's just here for trade bait. I'll try and, I'll try and sign him for three year, $26 million. He's going to try and take that into consideration. That's all good. Al Jefferson, I'll negotiate a contract with you. And I just want to sign you just so I can trade you later on. That's the only reason why I want to sign you. But he doesn't know that, so... <laughs> and I, the thing is, I'm signing all these good centers. But I, I don't plan to play with them because we have Boogie Cousins. Maybe one of them will keep. You never know. Um, he doesn't want to do that. So let's do 20, 21.5 mil. And he'll take that in, into consideration. Um, we'll try and sign Tristan Thompson. Yeah, we'll try, and t we'll try and sign Tristan Thompson. Which then maybe we can... Tr unless... It, it depends how much he wants. And Tristan Thompson might be a guy that we just keep on this on the team. Twenty-four million dollars for three years. Um, I'll give you twenty. Yeah, I'll give you twenty for three years. And he'll take that into consideration. The Lakers. This is what the Lakers have been trying to do for the last couple of years: just sign guys on contracts. And J.R. Smith. The Cavs seem to be breaking up. The Cleveland Cavaliers seem to be breaking up. LeBron's here. Timothy Mozgov, Tristan Thompson, J.R. Smith. Oh, Matthew Delavadova. All right, so J.R. Smith, let's offer him a contract. I like J.R. Smith. Come off the bench. Maybe maybe he can do some work for us. Um, two year, $13 million. We'll give you two year, two year, nine million. I know it's a bit low, but we'll just see what you say. 10.5. Five seven. Okay, he'll take that into consideration. So let's skip over. Let's advance to the next day. See who signs or who doesn't. LeBron Wade is there. That's crazy to me. The big two. Where's where's Bosch? Where's the big three? Ah. Okay, we didn't get out, Jefferson. No. I should have signed these guys. I should have signed these guys to more money. Damn it. Because they they were gonna be my trade bait. They were gonna be my trade bait. You know, I'll just sign either one of them, really, because you never know. They might both decline, so... Um, two year, 13.84 year. I'll just give you... I'll just give you that, because I don't want to go and not get... I just want to, you know, get some players on this team, just so I can trade them away. Off contract. All right. So this is what I want the lineup to be. D'Angelo, Kobe, Wiggins, Randall... DeMarcus. That is a nice team. Let's advance to the next day. Myers Leonard is prepared to accept an offer from the Wizards. You will be giving you will be given the opportunity to match the contract. J.R. Smith I'll sign. Deng I'll sign. Batum I'll sign. Three year 12 million I'll sign Myers Leonard. Tristan Thompson decides to sign with the Indiana Pacers. Please Joel Green I offered you a contract. I want you to come back and join this team. Larry Sanders you have some high value in 2k just because it's 2k you have high value off of the contract I think Joe Green okay we get Larry Sanders is Joe Green not here Gerald Green why did you have to leave me now what is my team looking like front office 
a soul pod position. Point guard. Wait a second. We have a lot of centers, by the way. We can run my Leonard. Actually, no, this guy, he's not even going to be in our team. Um, Kobe's going to be. I don't. Okay. We need a backup point guard, in fact. Um, Jordan Clarkson, I signed you, didn't I? Well, at least I tried to. Maybe you just didn't want to sign back with us. Good. Jordan Clarkson. And I can't believe Joe Green left us, man. Uh, we don't really need an our shooting guard, so I'm not going to go after. I mean, Terrence Ross, 85 shot three, and he has a crazy dunk. I already know about Terrence Ross. Let's negotiate a contract. We'll give you a $10 million deal. $5 million for two years. We signed a few players that are like you, so I don't know. I don't mind you not signing with us. And we have anybody coming to us? It takes a long time to save. Okay. We got Jordan Clarkson accepting and... Ah! Everyone that I try and go for... I can't sign Trey Burke. Alright. So pretty much that's that's been free agency right here. It's been a weird free agency. Like, none of the guys I really wanted I got. I, I wanted Hassan Whiteside. I, but... I didn't really want them. I wanted guys so that I could trade them, but man, my owner is not happy at the moment. But at least we signed a few guys. Player progression. Kobe obviously went down because he's old. Demarcus went down in the three-point shot, but he went up in standing layup. Why has Demarcus gone down in a lot of categories? Defense he's gone up in. That's great. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm kind of happy with with who we got, only because then I can trade him later on. Um, Summer League, this should be exciting. Build manually. Your team will need a complete roster of 13 players in order to, en to enter the Summer League. What would you like to do? Build manually. I can get all these guys in? Well, that's cool. And I can... Obviously, let's get Trade Burke. Let's get Mahimi. Let's get Henderson. Let's get Cadwell Pope. Bismack Biombo. Ray McCallum. I like this team. Randall, Russell, Clarkson, Burke, Henderson, Mahimi, Pope. Mia. This team is nice. It's like a young, pretty cool team. I want to see how hot, how this guy plays. We drafted him in the second round, so. Wait, do we actually get to play in the Summer League? Or do we get, like, people telling us how they played? I'm not sure. We get to play? Yo, that is dope. So I'm going to end the episode here. If you want to see the next episode where we play up against the Hornets, on oh no, the Hornets, play up against the Pelicans in the Summer League, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. If we can reach 500 likes, I'm going to face up against the, the uh, Pelicans in the next episode. Speedy Bonnet Smith, I'm out. Peace. That's dope, man. I'm, I'm hyped to play in the Summer League. <laughs> I'm out. Peace.